We are in the midst of a national student debt crisis. Today, Senator Mark Warner visited the University of Virginia to address the issue with those most affected, students. NBC 29's Jenna Dagenhart was there. She joins us tonight with that story. Hi, Jenna. Hi, Casey. Thank you. Student debt in the United States is surpassing credit card debt at $1.2 trillion. And 2014 graduates this spring became the most indebted class ever. about possible solutions to the crisis. Senator Warner said he's currently working on three, bill on three bipartisan bills in the Senate. The goals are income-based repayment of student loans, employer assistance in debt repayment, and transparency so that students know as much as possible before they choose a school. But before I talking hear the with the students, Warner listened. I want to hear the stories from these students. I want to share some of my ideas. I want to hear their feedback. And my hope is that this is something when we go back into session next week or hopefully after the election we could see actually get done uh, this year. Because with these numbers going up on a national basis, uh, when, we, when we're seeing home sales not rebound the way because people aren't able to buy that first house, this is going to be potentially a, a real drag on the economy unless we can get it fixed. And so it's very important that Mark Warner works not just to fight it but also to make sure that students now are informed about it so that they can continue to fight this issue further down the road. Warner told the students he believes college needs to be affordable so that they can get a fair shot at success. Senator Warner also wants access to income-based Pell Grants for qualified high school students, allowing them to take up to one semester of college courses in high school. All right, Jenna Dagenhart, thank you so much. And